from Bendigo in central Victoria. Today I've um, actually brought two things along. They're connected but different. So the first thing that I have is a baptism gown. The baptism gown was my mother's. Um, she's 78. Mine, I'm 53. My daughters, twin daughters, only one of them wore this though. They're 33 today. My sons and my grandsons. So yeah, there's a lot of history in this one. My actual grandmother made it. So that's the first part. So this is sort of about me coming into the world and um, my start in life. The next thing I've brought along is the book. It's um, the Book of Inspiration for Women by Women. This was uh, been written by a lot of women from all over the world. I was asked to take part in this because of a journey that I'd been on in the last two years. My journey was that in 2015, I underwent some surgery that failed. As a result, I died, was um, on life support, um, had two lots of surgery um, to make me right again, I guess what you'd say. Put my family through a lot of anguish, um, heartache. I ended up spending four months in hospital, roughly, um, and home recuperating. Ended up with a lot of other problems to my body as a result of all that, um, body and mind. Um, it's just, yeah, implicate, you know, there's lots of things that have happened because of that. Um, as a result, a result of all the things that happened to me, I ended up with a colostomy bag, um, part of my bowel, most of my bowel's missing. So, as a younger person, even at the age of 51, I was then, I started a support group in the Bendigo area for women and men with um, colostomies and ileostomies because there were, we found that there was a lot of people that were a lot older that didn't necessarily want to talk about those sorts of things, whereas I wanted to. And um, I had a great support network of friends and family that encouraged me to do this. The result being a person that I had befriended through another area, social area, had asked me to take part in this book. Um, it's just about being positive. You know, out of all things that happened, there's a positive to it. So my life started, it ended, and it started again. Legacy, um, it means something that I want to leave to my children mainly, yeah, to the world, but mainly more to my children. Um, this being passed down, um, through the generations would be ideal. If that could go on for hundreds of years, I would be very happy. Um, the book is another thing that, you know, they have copies of the book and I would like to see that passed on. Yeah.